If you're a broker in Canada, one thing that's going to be really important when you're using a CRM like Blue Mortgage is getting your data from Phyologix Expert into a system. Uh, we're going to show you how you can do that quite easily within Blue Mortgage. So to start, what you'll want to do is just make sure that you've configured your import properly. And how you're going to want to do that is actually you go to the settings area here, and then under your marketplaces where you can find what's called an extension. And that's basically how we've set this up as an extension to import your data. So I've come to my extension area and here you can see there's my Phyologix import extension there. I can configure it. And what's really important on this screen is this area here. And so what this is, is on the left-hand side, these are the predefined stages that will exist in an extract from Phyologix. So you can see all the different stages in progress, approved, accepted. And then on the right-hand side, you can actually choose which stages goes to in Blue Mortgage. So we have some predefined ones as you're seeing here, but let's say maybe you've changed the stage or you want approved to go somewhere else. That's perfectly fine. You could just come in here and choose to go, okay, actually, this is gonna go to underwriting in progress if you want to, for example. <clears throat> so that's the step one, making sure that the statuses and phylogics are being imported to the right stages in Blue Mortgage. Once this is complete, you could just hit save. I'm gonna actually change this back. So I'll just say conditionally approved and hit save. So once you have your uh, settings all set up, then you can actually work on the import. And to do that, you just have to go to this, the Phylogix import extension. And what it's gonna prompt you for is just simply a CSV file. And specifically what it's looking for is actually the consolidated file that you'll get from Phylogix. So <clears throat> to do that, we'll just hit browse. I've opened up a little screen here. I'm just gonna select the right file. So I'll double click that and you can see we start the upload. This takes about a minute or two, so I'm just gonna stop the video and then I'll show you the end result. So now you can see here on my screen, it says import successful. So that's great, looks like it worked. And let's see the end result of that. <clears throat> so what I'll do actually is I'll go to my audit log just to see everything that's happened. <clears throat> So once again, I've gone to my settings and I can see that quite a few things have, have happened here, but the big one being something has been updated in this mortgage. So it looks like it was a pre-existing mortgage. That's great to know, but what I can see here is this is exactly what happened. So this stage, or pardon me, this deal came in. It came exactly in the right stage that I wanted it to. And every single one of the borrowers that were on this deal are now attached to it. You can see that here, all these different borrowers have been attached. If I click into a particular borrower, all of their details have been reflected, their mailing street, their phone number, their email address, even their date of birth, we can see all of that. <clears throat> and if I go back, that'll exist for each of the borrowers. Scrolling down, I get a ton of information about the deal itself. The amount of the mortgage, closing date, first payment date, maturity date, lender name, mortgage rate, all the things that existed in the file are now reflected here. So you can see how quick that was, how easy that was. And with that, you get a wealth of information that you can then use to start marketing to your clients. So this is a great tool. And one of the reasons that brokers all across the country are using Blue Mortgage to market and manage the processes for their clients. Thanks a lot.